was a medic in to care cancer came in patients, and I loved my patients, they were great. And um, then when I got out, I ended up being a phlebotomist, and I was an OI technician. And I also worked at Red Cross, uh, Blue, uh, yeah, Red Cross um, uh, getting blood for donors. I understand what people go through, how they look at things medically, speaking as patients and also um, uh, practitioners working on patients too. I'm a cancer survivor times four, and had a, a, my, I guess major one was the breast cancer, and, and that you know, I had a, a double mastectomy, but I'm a survivor of 10 years now. I have arthritis, I have degenerative joint disease, but right now that's where the most pain is. Everything, and I'm hoping this will help deal with that. Okay, the, oh, the first thing I wear has been bothering me a lot is my fingers. With the arthritis, and I get like shooting, shooting sharp pains in my fingers. Oh, I can also get my toes too. And uh, that with those. No, that, that, that's like number one primary that they had told you so now. And the other thing is um, uh, my hips and stuff like that. I've had one hip replacement. I'm supposed to have <laughs> both knees replaced. It's like all my joints have to be replaced. I'm hoping that will pretty much um, be a lot better. And I would like to get back and be active with swimming and, and I was being track. And, you know, I was quite athletic before. And so I'd love to get my whole new body back, basically. I'm hoping I can have some freedom back, of, you know, physical freedom, that is. Of, of, and also, I want to, there's a lot I would do if I could physically do it. It kind of sounds funny in a way, but to help other people also. And I, especially I have all this free time now being retired and um, kind of like retired early but I was in and out of different mini surgeries and stuff and um, I would like to just get back and help other people in one form or the other you know and that would make me very happy.